Hey everybody, I'm Eva Rupert, the Motorcycle Community Coordinator for Overland Expo, and this is our 2022 Ultimate Overland Motorcycle Build, the Yamaha Tannery 700, and it is the ultimate platform for the ultimate build that we are doing this year. So this year we started with a fantastic platform. It's the Yamaha Tenere 700 2022, and this is a wonderful middleweight, super capable motorcycle and a fantastic platform for this build. So we added a few things up here on the handlebars. I'll start over here with our double take mirrors. Double take has these really awesome fold away, unbreakable housing mirrors that are a game changer in adventure motorcycling. For our ergonomic setup, we added a set of bar risers from Altrider, which makes it really easy to get your hands on the handlebars, especially when you're standing up off-road. It just changes the ergonomics and is totally key for successful off-road riding. For our navigation and communication setup, we partnered up with Ram mounts, and we have this really great two-part mount that holds our cell phone for navigation and our Zolio satellite communicator in case we get into any sort of trouble in the backcountry. Our luggage partner this year was Moscow Moto, and we have a multi-piece luggage system from those guys. Up front, we've got their Nomax tank bag that doubles as a backpack, removes easily from the bike, and includes a hydration reservoir so you can sip and stay hydrated when you're on the trail. Back here, we've got the Backcountry 25 Panniers and the Backcountry 30 Duffel. And this is a really winning combination as far as luggage goes. Keeps the bike really balanced, small, low profile, but holds a ton of stuff. The backcountry duffel on the top has this beaver tail for storing extra stuff. It has double roll ends on either side so you can access your gear inside from either side of the bike and it cinches really tightly to the motorbike with a set of straps. Inside of the backcountry duffel there's this convenient pouch and we've got the Acclimate Combar Titanium Pro. This is a really super useful multifunctional camp tool with everything from a hatchet and a trenching tool to all kinds of knives and other useful camp stuff stored in the handle. It fits perfectly right in here. Another important part of our build this year is this really innovative toolkit from SBV Tools. It is packed full of some of the most useful, cleverly designed tools I have ever come across. Wrenches and hexes and Torx bits and ratchets and everything packs down into this really tidy little case and the kit is equipped to make any roadside repairs that you might come across in the field. So all of our luggage, our panniers and our top duffel are secured with this Outback Motor Tech luggage system. So we've got a luggage rack on the pillion, behind the pillion seat. We've got these pillion grab handles that also double as great attachment points for any sort of lashings or webbings that we're using. And then the Moscow bags pair perfectly with the pannier racks from Outback Motor Tech. All of the materials that Outback makes their pannier racks out of are super crash resistant. And not only do they provide a secure position for your luggage, they add some protection for the exhaust and everything going on on the back end of the motorcycle. Back here on the rear end of the motorcycle, we removed the entire rear fender assembly and replaced it with this Alt Rider tail tidy. This is a single piece aluminum tail tidy that removes the entire fender and makes these great attachment points for your license plate, rear blinkers, as well as your license plate light and your stock brake light that comes standard with a motorcycle. This is one of those things where we lose significant pounds making the rear end of the motorcycle lighter and really tidying up the back end of the bike. We replaced the OEM foot pegs on the Tenere with these really excellent Alt Rider foot pegs. They're much wider, much longer, and much more substantial, so it really increases your ability to control the motorcycle, particularly off-road. Having a center stand on a motorcycle is one of my favorite things for making roadside repairs and chain maintenance much easier. So we also added this Outback MotorTech center stand to the Tenere 700. One of the things that we added from Alt Rider is this clutch arm extension. And so this completely changes the clutch pull on the motorcycle and it makes it so easy to pull the clutch in and really control the friction zone on your motorcycle. Great little piece from Alt Rider that bolts right on. Easy installation and so helpful. We also added a water pump guard from Alt Rider. This piece is a single piece of billet aluminum that totally protects all of the water pump housing, which is plastic down low and very prone to breakage because it's in such a vulnerable position. Another one of my favorite ergonomic enhancements comes from Alt Rider, and this is a two-piece 
dual control brake pedal and riser. This is one of those little things that absolutely changes the way you ride and it changes your reaction time when engaging the rear brake on the motorbike. This bolts simply to the brake pedal itself and you've got this riser platform up here and then a wide flat brake enlarger down below. Our crash protection on this motorcycle is from Outback Motor Tech and we added the ultimate adventure combo which includes upper and lower crash bars, the bash plate down below, it also includes pannier racks and the luggage rack on the back. And Outback Motor Tech does a really incredible job with their crash protection. They make every crash bar to be as light and protective as absolutely possible. It's very cleverly engineered. Everything is frame mounted so it keeps the integrity of your bike in place in the event of a bad crash. And they're great looking and incredibly sturdy. One of the things that we wanted to do with the Tenere 700 was to double down on its dual sport capabilities. And one of the things that we did with that was to remove the low OEM fender and replace it with this high fender kit from Altrider. The low fender that comes stock on the motorcycle is prone to getting stuffed with debris or mud in sloppy or wet conditions. And taking that fender off and replacing it with this Altrider high fender just gives us the opportunity to have plenty of space around the wheel. The suspension upgrade on the Yamaha Tenere that we did is done with tractive components. We put a long travel suspension that adds 25 millimeters front and rear to the bike and really increases the dual sport and off-road capabilities of this motorcycle. Ted Porter from the Beamer Shop did the front fork rebuild with tractive components and we also added a rear shock from tractive making this bike an incredibly capable machine. The radiator on the Tenere 700 is prone to being pinged with rocks and dirt and debris that can eventually damage the radiator. So we replaced the plastic radiator guard on the Tenere with this really nicely machined aluminum radiator guard from Altrider. It allows plenty of airflow to keep the bike cool, but also protects the radiator itself from debris and rocks on the trail. Our lighting kit on the Tenere 700 is from Ruby Moto, and this is the R4 kit, and this is a really beautiful lighting kit. We've got two lights on either side. The controller is up on the handlebar. These are fully adjustable, and they have some of the finest optics available in the world of motorcycle lighting. No adventure motorcycle is complete without a great set of knobby tires. We went with the Bridgestone Battle Axe AX41s, and these are one of those tires that really balances the durability for long haul trucking on the pavement with super capable knobby tread patterns for the off-road. To tie the whole look of the Ultimate Overland Motorcycle build together, we turned to our friends at Taco Moto who designed this really incredible graphics package for us. It's sort of a topographic map riff and I really feel like it's the thing that brings this whole beautiful motorcycle together. From top to bottom, this machine is truly incredible. I can't wait to get every last mile that I can possibly eke out of this thing under my belt on it. It is as capable off-road as it is for long haul trucking. It looks beautiful, it rides strong, and the Yamaha Tenere 700 was the perfect platform for this year's Ultimate Overland Motorcycle build. If you love it a lot, it's gonna be up on the auction block at the end of the year, and the charity that it will support is the Overland Expo Foundation. Thank you guys so much for checking out our build walk around. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out to us over at Overland Expo, and stay tuned to all of the great content that's out there about this motorcycle as we take it on more adventures, more wild rides, and create more great content for you.